Hey fam, I'm Gogo and welcome back to Gogo's Corner. So I'm driving to work this morning and I wanted to do this yesterday but things did not work out that well so that I could do this. So I'm going to do this today because there's something that's been on my heart and I wanted to talk about it. Um, getting on the highway. So what I wanted to talk about today was something called Dark Night of the Soul. And I'm not sure how many of you are familiar with that or who know what that is. But it's basically um, the death of ego, of the spirit. So when you're going through a dark night of the soul, it's a time of reflection, of transformation, of you just realizing what's happening and the truth of the things around you so um it's literally a spiritual death in a sense you a lot of the times you will go through a depression once you hit an awakening you know some people feel like they're awake already and that's fine like i'm not saying you're not I'm just saying, when you go through the dark night of the soul, you hit a serious spiritual awakening. You see things. You feel things more deeply. You are more connected. You feel like you're more connected to to source and get so far away at the same time. And that's the best way that I think I can describe it. It's like going through a tunnel where you feel like there are so many people around you. You can see these people. You can interact with these people. But at the same time, you are completely alone. You recognize the, the world as it is. You become more sensitive to things. Sometimes, like, the empathetic people, like me, will begin to feel things more deeply. So, before, where you would cry at a movie that was designed to make you cry because it was it's a sad movie... Now you'll see commercials that have sad elements to in, into it and, and you cry at those. Like you'll see people who are happy and you cry for them. Like and it's not just like you're crying because they're crying. You're crying because you actually feel what it's like to have gone through what they're going through, even though you've never been through it. So you empathize with people on an entirely different level. So the dark night of the soul um feels like like just the biggest depression ever it feels like you finally realize the truth of the world around you and now you have to figure out how to live with it you've realized the truth and now you need to figure out how to live with it you need to figure out how to live with yourself inside this this dynamic that's happening on the planet and it's not always the easiest thing to do because there are other people who have no idea that this is happening for you. You know, they haven't reached a dark night of the soul yet for themselves. And it can happen in just your awakening life. It can happen in your relationships. It can happen in just your life transformations. You can reach a certain age and all of a sudden the world falls apart from under you. And I think right now on the planet we are going through like it's a great awakening in a sense we're in the age of Aquarius and in the age of Aquarius all things that were hidden before on the planet there's an element of light that comes that comes current like you can't hide things forever anything that's in darkness at some point you have to have the light shown on it because there's the balance in that so things that have been hidden from you on the planet things that the government is lying about things that people um around you are lying about they you know might might think that somebody's your best friend only to come and find out that they are so not they've been against you from the beginning things like this will come up you know and you makes you feel more alone than ever you can laugh you can joke you can smile you can pretend you can go through the motions and at the same time you are really struggling you are really struggling with knowing what your place is in the world and and how to go about um, manifesting that 
you know and so when you hit this point and it's much bigger than what I can actually convey if you haven't felt it before and and you or, or you're feeling it now and you don't know what this is that's what it is it's your one of your moments of awakening um, and I've had a couple in my life and so right now I feel like I um, have a handle on on what that is like you know so this time around while the planet is going through this awakening I already knew I already knew this was coming. I I knew it already. So it's not such a big deal for me, but for some people, like it's it's earth shattering, you know, um, to have your relationships that you thought 